Let's call the case of the people versus Forbes Dabney. Andrew Bannis, Assistant Public Defender, with on behalf of Mr. Dabney. Truth Science appearing on behalf of YouTube. What's your name? My name is Forbes Dabney. I'm a national, and I am not sure if I'm able to get a, the truth of the court, so I need help. And a friend is standing by with all the legal things that I can do to stop these things in private and against my bonds. I don't know what to say. I don't want him to represent me. Pardon? I do not want him to re represent me. I want my friend and my legal person to represent me or help me. So you don't want a licensed attorney to represent you. You want your friend to represent you because you're a national. Gotcha. This should be good. But I'm pretty sure the judge isn't going to allow your random friend to represent you. Okay. okay. So. I'll come back to what you're saying, Mr. And you were saying what? Your Honor, after I reviewed the discovery, I initially had some competency concerns. Um, but I wasn't going to follow through before speaking with Mr. Dabney. Um, and it's okay. You, and um, I called him, but I didn't hear back from him. But I was happy to see he was here today. And so I did ask to speak with him, and he very politely declined to speak with me. Okay. So I can't hear very well. You can't hear. Can we get equipment, please? Can you hear me now, Mr. Dabney? Yes, I do. All right, very good. You need to take that. My bail is not going to hold that for you. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay, so Mr. Dabney, are you intending on representing yourself? No, I come to settle this. There's uh, cusp numbers, there's bond and all these things with my social, my, uh, uh, my called uh, birth certificate. There's money they're sitting for there. There's what? There's money sitting for that. For what? This case. Do you have a case before you, Forbes Dabney Jr.? Oh, I do. Well, that's do all I want to do is settle it. Okay, but you understand, do you understand what you're charged with? No, I don't. Okay, so when you went for the you remember being arraigned? I don't remember that either. I don't understand that either. So we need to... Okay, hold, hold on. Where hold, is just hold on, Mr. Dabney. I just want to go back here. Uh, back on November 21st of 2023, do you remember appearing before Magistrate Fink? No, I've had a... Okay, okay. So okay, so dealing with okay, so when right? okay, so hold on. What, when did you have the stroke? This is two thousand something like two thousand twenty or somewhere around there. Okay, so you were before the magistrate on on November twenty first, two thousand twenty three. Do you remember that? Yes, but the circumstances concerned, I'm not sure all that. Okay, so but you re do you remember? Questions. Okay, but do you remember being before the magistrate? I don't know the dates. I don't know. Okay, so let's right. So let's try this. I come here to settle it. As a I, I I understand, but I've got to make sure of a couple of things. Okay, so that's why I'm asking some of these questions. Sure. Do you remember appearing before me before on December 7th, 
You may not remember the date. You remember appearing before me? Don't recall everything, but yeah. I don't know. I don't know. You don't know if you appeared before me? There's so many things that happened over the time. No, no, I understand, but... Um, this defendant is clearly lost and needs some legal help. I just want to make sure I'm trying to figure out what you remember because you, you're telling me you don't understand what you're charged with, right? Right. I don't okay. Know. All right. That's fine. Do you remember seeing me in court on December 7th or December 21st? I remember this, but I don't know. Do you date. remember what? Don't remember the date. Okay. But do you remember being here? Yeah. I see you looking around the room. I'm looking at this building. I do remember it, yes. Okay, but do you remember being before me? But I don't remember the date. Right, I, I, I get that. But do you remember being before me? Yes, I think I do remember. Well, it, hold on. Hold on, Mr. Dabney. If you don't remember, you need to just tell me I don't remember. It's okay. But I just need to know if you're not recalling it. I don't know how to answer it. I had a stroke. <clears throat> okay, but you had a stroke back in 2017 or 18, you said, right? Whatever that happened, yes. I was, um, I do remember their records that show that I was uh, the Wayne County or Wayne City Airport. Okay. Or uh whatever. And they held me, and that's when I got hit upside the head. That's when the stroke happened. Okay, I see. Okay, let me ask you. It's, it's okay if it's true, Mr. Dabney. Do you have problems remembering things at times? Is that why you had the person you wanted to help you help you? Yes. Okay, so you have problems remembering sometimes. The person that's standing by right now, he says he will come when I come here. He, I can call him now. Okay. I lost this phone, uh, so I lost my phone. Okay, so Mr. Dabney, here's what I'm going to do. Okay, after talking to you, sure. Because I have to make sure that you understand the proceedings that are happening and what you're charged with and the like. Right. Okay. I don't. That. Right. Right. Okay. Okay. That's a big part of what I have to do. Okay. Okay. So, um, and I'm a little bit concerned. OK, for you, because you told me you had a stroke and then you're telling me there's some things you don't remember. And just hold on. Just let me let me just finish. OK, sure. And then um, I gave you your three dates that you've been in our court here. And you said you didn't remember being before the magistrate and you didn't remember being before me. OK, I what I needed. Pardon? I was looking for a trial by church. A uh, trial? I didn't get that. Got it. Excuse me, sir, but what in the doohickey are you talking about? Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. Yeah. Um, on my motion, on uh, I'm doing this. Their public defender's not doing that. I may have them prepare the order. Oh. Okay, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to order a competency evaluation of your forensic evaluation just to make sure that you can understand the proceedings. Okay? My friend, will they be with me? Pardon? Can they be with me? Who? My friend. For the evaluation? For other legal battles, too, yes. Okay, if the person... could be easily solved. Pardon? With the money. Right. I, okay. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to order a competency evaluation. I'm going to give you another date to come back. You're going to meet with somebody in between then. They'll communicate with you regarding your appointment with them. Well, and if you, they let, hold on, if they let your friend come, that's fine with the court. Okay. So are you saying this, that I will not have my trial by jury? I'm not saying that at all. I'm just telling you, your trial by jury may happen later. It's not going to happen today. 
Okay. Okay. You're not giving up any of your rights whatsoever. Okay. I just have to make sure of certain things before we can proceed on this case. Sure. Okay. Yep. Fair enough. Yeah. Okay. So, I'm sorry. So what I will do is I I'm signing the order on competency or for a forensic evaluation and for criminal responsibility. And then, Mr. Dabney, I'm going to give you another date to come back and see us, okay? So, I'll set the um, hearing for... Hey, I'm going to set your new date for April 18, 2024 at 9 a.m., okay? They're going to give you a notice. Okay, so here's what I want you to do, Mr. Dabney. When so, what's going to happen is you're going to get a letter, or you're going to get some communication from somebody indicating that you need to meet with them. And now I have my proper persons with me. Then you, you can you can bring somebody with you as yeah. long as who's yeah. talking to you says it's okay. Sure, you can do that. I'm not going to have a problem with that. Okay, okay, but what I want you to know is. You might get something from Mr. Bannis or his office about when you need to meet with that person. And so if you do, you need to pay attention to that. Okay? I need to pay attention to what? The paper? The paper. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Defendant's bond will continue. All right. Thank you, Your Honor. I want this. What's the new date? Uh, April 18th. Thank you. All right, Mr. Dabney, you yep. take care. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Oh. Mr. Dabney, this is just a reminder of your next court date. And it also has my phone. Mm -hmm. This is for you, so you remember your next court date. Thank you. All right. Yeah, take Mr. Dabney, take that. So I, I told him to give that to you so that you had it you had it in your possession, okay? All right, you take care. One week later. For calls case, people versus Forbes Dabney. They're not here, are they? Pardon? Forbes Dabney. Not here. Warren Brown, Deputy Chief. On behalf of Mr. Forbes Dabney. I had intended to uh, request that this matter be adjourned because we didn't have the updated um, competency evaluation. Right. I, I see that, but we don't know where he is. Yeah. Okay. Well, we can look at him. Bench warrant will issue for defendant's failure to appear. Bond will be set in the amount of 10,000 cash surety. Bless you. That warrant will issue immediately. I had a feeling he wasn't going to show up to court. That man was very spaced out. Court recalls case people versus Forbes Dabney. We're ready then. Lauren Brown, public defender, right? Approaching the uh, audience. Special appearance. Special appearance. No, sir. Yes. are special, but no, this is not. Mm -hmm. What is it? Regular. 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 Special appearance with the uh, attorney, all those guys. Can we do that? Right. First, you want to get to the competency, which is what this is. I don't need the confidence. I need what I need. It's my car, that's why I'm not late. Oh, right. right. So uh, let me explain that to Judge, so he knows why you're late. And that way, you will um, go back to you. Well, okay. So, yes. I think you usually wear the green. 
Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Oh, uh, okay. Do you need you need yes, to? Yes. Right, right. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Miss Hughes, for remembering for reminding us. Put this away. Yes, go ahead and put it in your pocket. You can. If you want to put this, let's put this down here. So. Oh, okay. Thank you. Appreciate it. You know. <laughs> Sorry, you hold on to that. Sorry, you hold on to that. Hey, how y'all doing? <laughs> what, you hold this? Oh, I hold this? Okay, thank you. All right, so can you hear me okay? I hear you fine. Now. All right. Your Honor, uh, as a sheet metal worker, I had many, as a sheet metal, many years, and my hearing is gone, so... Uh, Okay. So, All right. So, uh, Your Honor. Yes. This is Mr. Uh, Forbes Dabney. Dab, my last name. Right. My family name is Dabney. It is. And okay. my first name, they call me Forbes. All right. Forbes. That's who this is. That's what I So, Your Honor, uh, earlier this know. case yes, was sir. called, mm -hmm. and uh, Mr. Dabney had car problems. He was broken down. It's, uh, it's, it's in the belt. Yeah, the ser serpentine belt. And broke That's the generator. Yeah, so yeah. That problems. Yeah. Yeah. There's the whole thing in there on an old car. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so we would respectfully request that the court recall the bench warrant. Yeah. I recall the bench warrant. Thank, Thank you. you. Your Honor. Okay. You're welcome. And now, um, this matter, as the court may recall, this is set for competency review here. They have not repeated, uh, completed the evaluation at this time. So we were asking, or we we're going to ask, that this matter be adjourned so that that they could complete that evaluation and we could move forward in this case. Thank you. Do they, you're, you're my attorney or something? I am. <laughs> That's okay. who I am. Okay. I'm Lauren Brown. You're what? Lauren Brown. Lauren Brown? Lauren. Lauren Brown. Glad to meet you. Glad okay. to meet you. Okay. What else do we need to do? We well, to do you need to... <laughs> to talk to him? No, 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 hold on. Just, you just sit tight. You're good. Okay, thank you. I'll set the competency hearing then review hearing out to May 16th. All right. Okay, I'll need copies of that because 2024, 9 a.m. or as is it might indicate. Thank you. All right. Yes. Thank you so much, Robert. Fine, we'll continue. Right. The warrant is recalled. All right, thank you. I didn't hear the last part. He said, Bond will continue. You're oh, all oh. set. You're free to go. Thank you, sir. But you got to leave our stuff with us. Say again? You got to leave this stuff with us. Stick with you? No, no. Give him, <laughs> give him that. <laughs> Just, <laughs> Thank you.